Hey guys, welcome to the high ground. My name is Fabio. And if you're interested in how to perfectly coil a rope, stay tuned because that's the topic of today's video. Maybe to set this in advance, there is no real right or wrong method to coil a rope. The most important thing is that you can uncoil it easily and that you have a system that is applicable to a lot of situations. So if you have a way to coil your rope for putting it in your backpack and a way to coil your rope if you want to put it outside on your backpack and a way to coil your rope if you want to store it at home, you might think about that one because you really should have one system and one procedure that works almost everywhere. Now the start is fairly easy. I have my rope just laying in front of me and I put it over my, over my neck and I'm just making sure that this end is not longer than my arm. So I put it over my neck fairly short and then I grab the rope with this hand and just put it behind my neck. Then I grab the rope with this hand, put it behind my neck, behind my neck. And I'll do that until I have approximately two meters, something like that left. And I will speed up that sequ sequence for you. Now, what you can do is, you see, this, this rope is a fairly thin one. So it's only, I think, 8.7 millimeters. If you really have a thicker rope, you can just let go of the rope and start again. And here we are. We have approximately two meters left. And the first thing we do is we take the rope off without losing the middle of it like this. And here we go. Now this is the loose end of the rope. And you can see it comes from this side. And what I do now, and I'll show you that in detail in a second, I'm just having a little loop and then I'm going backwards. And then I start coiling the rope around the other strands of the rope. And for the first rotation, I'm going below and over. And now I can just continue coiling the rope. We might be a little bit long here, but should work. Voila. And here we go. Okay. We're going towards the end. And now if I only have a little of rope left, I just thread it through this loop. And now with a little tug on that loop, I can see which rope strand moves and I'm just pulling on this strand to close the coil up. And that's already it. You can throw it over your backpack. You can throw it into your backpack. You can just store it in any hut or at home. In my book, that's the perfect way to coil a rope. Now I'll show you all that stuff again in detail. Okay, here we are again with our not yet coiled rope. And as I said, this is the finished strand. It walks over here. And I have approximately two meters of rope left. So the first thing I do, I come up with the exit strand of the rope and I produce a small loop on top of the coil here. And make sure that you get a little bit of this end of the rope pulled up so that later you will see when, when we tighten the loop, there is not much rope hanging out on the other side. And then as said, you're going over the coil or around the coil and then once cross the rope up here. That's important just to hold it in place. And then you just pull it tight 
and start wrapping it around until you have a certain amount of stability. It's a little bit cumbersome, but in a second we'll be off and running. So now you have it like this and then you can just coil it around until you're done with the whole rope. And it's personal preference if you want to have this part a little bit wider or smaller. I like it wide, especially when I put it on top of my backpack because it gives me a nice weighted center. Okay. Okay. Almost there. Another wrap. And here we are. Then we stick it through the loop like this. And now we don't have to memorize which of these strands goes up to the loop. We just pull on it a little bit and then we see which one moves. Aha, uh -huh, it's this one. Just pull that tight. And so that this one is not hanging out of the end of the rope, this is why we shortened it a little bit earlier. And with that you have this perfectly coiled rope. It's super stable and you could put it almost anywhere. Okay guys, that's it for today's video. If you found any value in it, please give us a like, subscribe to the channel. I appreciate your time and I'll see you next time.